Middle schooler Barney Pudowski is the only kid in his class who doesn't have a B-Bot. His former childhood friends, Savannah Meads, Rich Belcher, Noah and Ava have all become absorbed by their individual B-Bots. Barney receives the B-Bot as his late birthday gift, but upon activating it, he quickly learns that it's defective and glitchy. Not wanting to upset his father, Barney decides to take it back to the bubble store to get it fixed, but ends up running into Rich and his friends who taunt and try to humiliate Barney. The B-Bot begins to fight back as his safety functions have been disabled, with him and Barney happily running off. Barney teaches Ron how to be a good friend and, while hanging out, runs into Savannah who tells Ron that he needs to help Barney get friends. Despite Barney telling Savannah not to, she posts Ron's actions online, alerting Bubble. The B-Bots run wild and, in the end, after the B-Bots have a patch update, Savannah is publicly humiliated. Barney is kicked out from school and tells Ron off, but upon returning home, realizes that Ron was truly being a friend and decides to run away with him. They briefly run into Savannah, still upset over her incident, and tells her that he is hiding in the woods. Meanwhile, while Andrew warns Mark about the ramifications of the B-Bot, Mark sneaks away so that he can meet Ron. Barney is taken to the hospital and recuperates before meeting Mark who patched Ron, making him like every other B-Bot. Barney demands that Mark access the cloud to get Ron's original personality, but Andrew took over the bubble company and locked Mark out. Through an elaborate plan for Barney, Graham, Donka and Mark breaking into Bubble HQ, Barney manages to make it to the bubble database and uploads Ron back into his body. Three months later, everyone has a faulty B-Bot. Barney no longer has one, but has become much more sociable and has gotten close with his former friends. As they hang out at recess, a giant bubble tower that overlooks Nunsuch produces Ron's face. Ron's